All right, good morning everybody. Welcome back to the channel. Today I've been messing around with my Model 3 and I wanted to show you guys something pretty cool. Uh, we're all familiar with the fact that, uh, or all of us that own Model 3s, with the fact that we only have that one slit for, uh, for the, uh, the climate control vents in the dash. Well, I took my dash apart and uh, I'll get into the reasons why in a little bit, but uh, I, uh, I've got um, at least some of an idea of how the system works. So uh, let me turn the camera around and show you what we have going on here. So this is the dash removed from the car. I've actually got the, the panel right here. And if you look, you can see this weather stripping around the panel. So that's the, uh, the wood panel. The way this system functions, you've got vents along here that blow air toward you. Now there is a slit of vents that blow, that blow up and adjust where the stream of air comes from. But if you look, there's nothing here to blow air up. But if you move back here, right at the center of the screen, there is this hole, that triangle shaped hole. And if you look down in there, there is a, uh, there's a baffle. See if I can show you that there. And if you, if you adjust, the airflow up and down that's for that's more up that opens up and you adjust it down and that baffle closes let me get this camera down in there more aiming the air up and that opens and down and it closes so kind of interesting there's there we go that's more in focus so let me do that again for you raising the vent up opens that and down closes it. Now, the way this system functions, uh, it's sort of interesting. Also, uh, that is only opening the passenger side. Uh, this has some um, dual zone climate control. So let's go to the driver's side. And there's the driver's side going up and the driver's side going back down again. So the way the system functions, air comes from this cavity here and fills this area like a, like a plenum in here. And again, I go back to this, this dash panel here is, is lined with foam. And then you've got this vent here. That vent corresponds with those slits right there. So what happens is air comes in through this slot and is controlled by that butterfly door for more or less air, fills this, this section as a plenum, and then that air comes out of those slits to aim upward and correspond with the air coming laterally or horizontally through the dash and the two blending together changes the height up and down but again you've got these butterfly doors in here that control the rate of airflow both for the passenger side and the driver's side plenum chambers to send air up into the cavity of the or into the cabin of the the car so very very cool figured you guys would get a kick out of that and uh, yeah, just a short video for today, but uh, I got a kick out of it and figured you would too. So anyway, have a great day, guys. Bye-bye now.